everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are really, really well. So I have a H&M haul today. I am obsessed with H&M. It's got so, so good, such a gorgeous collection. Just look at these gold and black and cream tones. It's just giving me all these vibes. So before we start, I wanted to introduce you to a jewelry brand that I've been obsessing over. If you watch my vlogs, I've mentioned them a lot in them because I literally have not stopped wearing them. Um, so it's a brand called Anna Luisa Jewelry. I have on one of their necklaces right now. So this is how you spell it in case you were wondering and they come in little boxes like this and I just think their jewelry is absolutely stunning. So I got a, th a stack of three necklaces and this this is one of the stacks and then this is another one but what I love about their stack necklaces is that they come separately so you don't have to wear them all together. And then there is this gorgeous pearl one too but as I said you can wear them separately as well which I think is great. Just look how stunning that design is. I also have this bracelet by Ana Luisa as well and I love wearing them with watches. I just love that combination just look how gorgeous and intricate it is and then as well I picked up these gorgeous little earrings which have been like my everyday kind of earrings I'm just obsessed so Anna Luisa believe in everyday luxury and they offer a complimentary one-year warranty on every product they use 14k solid gold that will not oxidize or tarnish and also it won't bend if you wear it every day their sterling silver is made from 92.5 pure silver matching the highest standards in fine jewelry I'll leave all the details to the jewelry down below so you can shop away I also have a discount code which you can use which I'll pop on screen here and yeah let's get into the video so let's start off with a blazer. I'm a big fan of tailoring. I think it's such an elegant kind of look and what I loved about this one was the waist belt around the middle. The perfect summer blazer. Not only for the office but also I'm a big lover of like this smart kind of vibe. It falls really really nicely. You'll see when I try it on too. So next is a skirt. I'm obsessed with skirts. I think they're so elegant for this time of year. This is from the Conscious Collection which is all about sustainability but look at these flecks of like shimmer through them so gorgeous especially in the Sun when you walk to go with it I picked up this little body because I thought this body was incredible for underneath shorts underneath skirts a really perfect thing for summer also great to wear stuff like this with it a really great summer piece next up I have another skirt this is a really long one to the floor really elegant but you could equally wear it to the beach with like a cami or a bikini or you could really glam it up sophisticate it with some heels some earrings some jewelry so I love these things that I picked out because you can wear them several ways I just picked up this little cami to go with it because I thought that worked really nicely together I love little camis like this because you can wear them with so many different things in your wardrobe so this next one is a gorgeous skirt it comes in a lot of different colors I think I've seen it in black multicolored so if you like the kind of style I'll leave a few options down below but I loved this drapage I thought it was gorgeous perfect for the beach you could wear it with a shirt again skirts are so great because you can style the top half to suit your wherever you're going or your style and I would probably wear it with a cami or something like that for the city and then next up we have this gorgeous kimono I love these kind of things because say if it's hot and you're out all day in shorts and a t-shirt like a little cami this is perfect to throw on over the top as it gets a little bit cooler also if you're on the beach in a bikini and you want to be a little bit more covered up this is such a demure kind of style just look at that beautiful bottom bit as well I've just got this stuck on the chandelier <laughs> I literally just it's, it's, Anyway, so let's talk accessories. I actually have this in snake print and I love the bag so much. When I saw it in black, I was like, this will do me so well for like that really handy bag. Just to, like throw on with a hat and you're all sorted. This is the vibe. This is what I wanted. <laughs> I love this. This is like me to a T. And like don't underestimate the power of a hat. I, start, I started trying to get my mum to wear hats because like me she's a burner so they're just ideal and she felt she felt really self-conscious in a hat and I was like mum you own the hat don't let the hat own you if you wear your hat with confidence no one will ever think otherwise and I just think they're so glamorous just wear the hat 
Don't let it wear you. I'm just going to continue wearing all the accessories because they make me feel a little bit fabulous. <laughs> I went to a shop called For Art's Sake. It's in Covent Garden. Beautiful shop for beautiful eyewear. And I picked up a pair of their sunglasses. So these are one of many designs. They come in this fabulous velvet box as well. Love that. I'm a sucker for beautiful accessories and I just thought these are insane. Look at the detailing on the side. Very excited about these. They're called For Art's Sake. It's definitely a beautiful eyewear brand if you're in the market for that kind of thing. So now that I've talked to you through all the pieces, let's get into the styling. enjoyed this video do let me know your favorite look what item was your fave in the comments below I'd love to know what you guys like also my podcast is gone live if you haven't heard I have a podcast it's called grown up it's motivating it's inspiring we have incredible guests on there so if you want a little pick me up midweek then definitely go check us out it's called grown up and we're on Spotify iTunes everywhere so I'll leave a link down below for you to go listen also my Instagram at Laura Blair come say hey and I'll see you soon for another video bye really love me after like a month yeah I would be like red flag red flag yeah so but we've all made that mistake or had Hi everyone, you're listening to Grown Up. I'm Laura Blair. And I'm Abby Blair. And we've all made those mistakes. Totally. So every, anyone listening to this thinking, oh, I'm so silly, I fell for it. Like, we've all done it. I run the UK's biggest dating coaching company. How do they go around getting over someone? Ladies, if we're doing this well, he's going to think he's done it. Okay.
into it. It just <laughs> makes you have heart don't. palpitations. Oh, no. <laughs> you don't need to chase around. Think of all the misspent energy. He was doing all the things that everyone told me were the right things about how I should be treated. We women, as yeah. we age, we get so much social pressure around, you know, yeah, being le it's left society, on the shelf. It's society telling us that we all need to settle down. Train, uh, train them like dogs. I like it. I did notice him checking me out on the squat rack. And I was <laughs> like, okay. Do you like that booty? But yeah. <laughs> I wasn't, um, that's, you know. a, that's a place where I would never be able to pick up a guy. My tiny ass would never <laughs> be able to do that. Also get women to realise that, you know, maybe that story that you've got in your head that, you know, you haven't got the right body shape, you're not the right age or whatever, maybe that actually isn't your story. Maybe that's a load of junk that the rest of the outside world has told you that you've now taken mm. on board. And in fact, you need to take ownership of who you are and start to feel really proud and really good about it. I'm not going to go on another date as I, I'm going to make myself happy on my own before I rely on someone else for my own happiness. And that was the best thing that I have ever done. You always, I think it's so important as well for if you are that like empowered woman and loads of women I work with, you know what, they're running their own businesses, they're smashing their careers. Mm. You cannot afford to have someone who's draining your energy or is non-supportive. Yeah. You're arguing with them all night, so you turn up feeling rubbish the next morning, you know, and you don't perform well at your career and your job that takes away from your friends. That is going to drain the life out of you. I it's one with Drew Barrymore in there. I was like, if I mate some Drew, should we get me a date? <laughs> you don't want someone to date you because you know Drew Barrymore, though, do you? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that, hey. I'm thinking these two are very rude. And we're just like miming at each other, like. <laughs> Something's going wrong. Well, I was trying to be like, he's not texting you back. But you should listen to her while I try and fix the mic. I, I think it will help a lot of girls out that are struggling. And hopefully men as yeah, well. Yeah, very interesting.